Windy and unpredictable weather conditions nationwide prompted Fiesta officials to cancel this year's America's Challenge race. Last night's liftoff was postponed after the winds failed to calm down. Then today at noon, Fiesta officials canceled the race entirely for the first time in 14 years. The Fiesta says it will refund the pilot's entry fees. News 13's Ian Schwartz talked to some of the pilots tonight about the cost of the cancellation. Yeah, Maria, gas balloon racing is an expensive sport, and pilots say they could be out thousands of dollars since the weather deflated their plans to race. Biggest, biggest the same wind that pushes this kite ruined pilot Kevin Knapp's chance to race across the country in this year's America's Challenge race. If we were to fly on this flight, uh, we'd be head spinning like this watching ahead of us and behind us um, because of the weather systems that were, were happening in the next couple of days across the United States. Balloons like these, which are powered by helium, are ready to go Saturday night, each filled with more than $6,000 worth of helium. All the balloons that we inflated last night, uh, we, we let that helium go and, and it's not recoverable. Knapp says many balloon baskets were also damaged as strong winds knocked them around the field as they waited to launch last night. Pilots also lost a lot of money in travel expenses, getting here to race only to head back home. Knapp says the canceled race is costly and frustrating, but adds you can't put a price on a life. We came here to fly uh, as part of uh, you know what, where we get our uh, uh, excitement and, and energy from. Uh, but we also want to be safe. This is the first time in 14, the 14-year 14 history of America's Challenge that the race has been canceled. The Balloon Fiesta plans to continue the race next year, Maria. All right, thanks, Ian. In the meantime, the gas division of Balloon Fiesta will determine which teams will represent the U.S. in next year's Gordon Bennett race to be held in England. Tomorrow, the Dawn Patrol is at 545. Then the Balloon Fiesta Hold'em Flying Competition is scheduled for 7 a.m., weather permitting. Gusting winds tonight force the cancellation of the Glodio, but the fireworks presentation went on as planned to the enthusiastic response of the crowds and that was followed by a concert.